Hello guys, my name is Prince and this is my center. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos. Post your comments and questions on my social media handles and I'll respond to it. We are on the topic mensuration. In the previous video, we learned how to find the total surface area, curved surface area and volume of a cylinder with both ends closed. In this video, we are going to consider how to find the total surface area, curved surface area and volume of a cylinder with one end open and the other end closed. Let's consider this question. A cylinder of diameter 4 cm and height 14 cm has one of its ends open. Find, correct to two decimal places, the total surface area, curved surface area and volume of the cylinder. So for this cylinder, one end is open and the other end is closed. And the diameter of the cylinder is 4 cm and the height is 14 cm. We are supposed to find the total surface area, curved surface area and volume of the cylinder and we correct our answer to two decimal places. Okay, so the diameter is 4 cm. It means that the radius is going to be 4 cm divided by 2 since diameter, since radius is equal to diameter divided by 2. So the radius is 2 cm and the height is 14 cm. The question said we should find the total surface area. This is a cylinder with one end open. So the total surface area is equal to pi r squared plus 2 pi r h. We saw this in the previous video. We have the radius as 2 cm and the height as 14 cm. So this will give us pi times 2 cm squared plus 2 times pi times 2 cm times 14 cm. If you find this on the calculator, you have shift pi sorry so shift pi times 2 squared plus 2 times shift then you, pl you press on times 10 to the power x that will give you pi times 2 times 14 and this will give us 60 pi the question did not tell us to leave our answer in terms of pi it said we should give our answer in two decimal places so you press on the S to D button and to give you your answer in decimals. The question said two decimal places. So you correct this here to two decimal places and that will be 188.50 centimeters squared. So the total surface area of this cylinder in two decimal places is 188.50 centimeters squared. The question also said we should find the curved surface area and the formula is 2 pi rh. So this will give us 2 times pi times 2 centimeters times 14 centimeters. Once again, if you do this on your calculator, you are going to have 2 times, you press on shift, then you press on this button to get pi times 2 times 14. And this will give us 56 pi. We want our answer in decimal, so you press on the S to D button and to give your answer in decimal, then you correct that answer to two decimal places and you have 175.93 centimeters squared. So the curved surface area of the cylinder is 175.93 centimeters squared. If you want to learn how to correct your answer to a given decimal place, watch the video the videos on approximations i explain how to correct your answer to a given decimal place there the question also said we should find the volume of the cylinder and this is giving us pi r squared h so you have pi times 2 centimeters squared times 14 centimeters if you do this on your calculator and you correct your answer to the decimal place to two decimal places you have 175.93 centimeters cube. So the volume of the cylinder is 175.93 centimeters cube. Thank you for watching this video. Subscribe to this channel for more videos. In the next video, we are going to learn how to find the total surface area, 
curved surface area and volume of a cylinder with both ends open. Bye-bye.